interviewed Yellow Beezy, who's also from Dallas. Yeah. Uh, and at one point, there, there was some sort of friction between y'all, and, and he explained it on another interview how it was just some stupid shit that a girl was trying to get in the middle of. Yeah. Yeah. So, so it, really, it really wasn't any kind of real beef. It seemed like the internet was trying to turn to something that it's not. Yeah, it wasn't. It wasn't. It wasn't. It wasn't. It wasn't no, nah. One okay. on yeah, and Yellow Beezy's dope, man. I, I think, you know, when you see people like you and Yellow Beezy and, and Go Yayo and everything else like that, I think that you guys are lifting Dallas, you know, just the perception of Dallas a lot. When Yellow Beezy got shot up, what were your thoughts about that? See, I got to stay out the way. It's real out here, shit. Niggas get hit up every day out here, like. It's, it's the world. Like, you know, somebody right now, we talking right now, somebody right now probably getting shot up right now. Like, you said, you got to stay out the way, man. There was a song that you dropped recently, and in the beginning of the intro, it's like a couple people talking, and it mentions you and Yellow Beezy. But yeah. I didn't really understand what it meant. Can you, can you explain that? Yeah, nah, you know, they was... uh. They was mis misinformed about some about some rap beef, and I was like, nah, I ain't got no rap beef with nobody. I ain't got no rap beef with no rap in my city. <laughs> no rap beef, and they was just all that was was just something that they heard, you know. Shit, you know they not in the street, so you know, their job is to report like the news. So you know they just going out what they heard, and, you know. So like, nah, I just cleared it up on my interview when I went up there and talked to them. Like, nah, ain't no rap beef, ain't no problem, man. Okay. Now, what happened between you and Trap Boy Freddy? What? The Trap Boy Freddy. What do you mean, what happened? I mean, there was a story that, that y'all had some sort of situation and there was supposed to be some surveillance footage. <laughs> of, you know, uh, someone getting ran down on the street or, or something. Did you see it? I did not see it. Oh, well, then I don't know what you're talking about because I don't know about nobody <laughs> running down no street. Well, well, hold on. Hold on. I'm pulling it up right now. Pull it, it up. It shows some... I'm pulling it up. So I guess he claimed that he ran you down last year and there's some surveillance footage. And I guess you, do you, you see, responded. Do you see somebody running down the street? Oh, I, I do not. Oh, okay. Well, I don't know what you're talking <laughs> about. Yeah, okay. 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 So so you're saying that all that is just nonsense? Yeah, I don't, yeah. That's, that's what I'm saying. Internet be reaching. Blair. I've had Trap Boy Freddy on my show. Shout out to all the rappers in my city. We is doing our thing. You get what I'm saying? We, right. We ain't talk about that. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm just saying. All, the, all the rap we doing, I ain't no, I ain't no rap beef, man. I ain't no rap beef. No, they can't, okay. they can't That's put not... me. People can't put me in no rap beef, man. I don't, I don't get into all that, man. I don't, I don't. I ain't my, they make my, my skin crawl like it's, 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 it's nasty, like. Well, I mean, that's what I want to hear, man, because, because. Dallas is popping right now, yeah. but all it takes is just a bunch of bullshit to happen between yeah. between the rappers, and then, you know, a lot of doors will get closed. Because I guess at one point you got banned from performing in clubs in Dallas, right? Hey, yeah, for shit, a uh, damn near a year. Right, that was over the shooting incident. Yeah. That right, so fucked, here you are. And that was fucked up. Right, you're one of the hottest dudes in the Something city. Something happened you in can't Fort perform. Worth, Forty-five minutes away from Dallas. Y'all telling me I can't come to clubs, I'm banning. Y'all trying to ban the music and all that. Something that happened 45 minutes away from Dallas. Like, I didn't understand. Right, and that's my point. I'm not here to try to, to drum up whatever yeah. beef it is. Like, I'm here to say, like, all this shit is bad for business. And ultimately, like, all y'all are winning in your own way. Yeah. And, you know, to put, put aside whatever bullshit, because this all just looks like bullshit, honestly, when I'm looking at it. Yeah, you know, I, I grainy, grainy footage and yeah, I don't even see that. You know, like, internet. Like, I don't even know. Like, I don't even know the niggas who sit behind computers and put stuff together. Like, we're gonna put this right here. This look like this. And put this together. Put this together. And make a big ass collage clip. Like, like an old ass PowerPoint back in the day. Like that shit goofy in the bitch. And like, and it just, I don't know nothing about none of that. Like, I live, like they, that shit crazy. You can't tell. You can't beat social media. The no. internet going to always win. So, like, it's like whatever they say, the people going to run with it. Like, so I don't even get into it. Well, like I said, man, I've, I've had both of y'all on my show now. And it just seems like it'd be good for the city for all the bullshit to get put aside. You know, y'all don't got to be best friends or y'all don't have to work on music together. Yeah. But 
but to just put the bullshit aside, everyone will end up making more money and getting more fans yeah. and doing more shows and, and getting bigger deals and everything else like that. So yeah. I just want to put that out there. Okay.